Hello everyone, and welcome back to Nick's Customs. Today, I will be showing off my custom 3D printed 7 plank trucks. These have been requested by people for a very long time, not just from me, but as a 3D printed item in general. It was going to be my first item to sell, but I didn't have the proper modeling skills yet. I have been computer modeling for a few years now, but I knew nothing about designing models specifically for printing, and I also didn't know how to get the plank details on the sides. I made some prototypes way back when, ones that resembled the Greyface Troublesome Trucks and Scruffy, but these just weren't feasible, especially for the details on the sides. All these little slots actually had material in them that I had to remove with a knife, and uh, that, that's just not fun. Earlier this year, I started the project again and wanted to make the trucks look accurate to the TV series. The first few didn't come out well, but eventually I got it ready. Well, almost. This little piece right here was like a couple millimeters off, and I printed 10 of them, so I've kept them for myself, and the fixed versions are what will be sold. These trucks were meant to resemble the ones seen in the CGI series, which are pretty much the same as the model series ones. They aren't 100% accurate, but I'm not going to print out every individual rivet just for it to get sanded over. I think the more simplified look fits better in with Wooden Railway. Wooden Railway doesn't have molded on rivets, so why should this? Don't get me wrong, though. These are still pretty detailed. They hold cargo pieces, since these are meant to replace cargo cars, but they can also hold pretty much whatever your imagination desires. Like several other 3D printed items I've designed, I'm selling these on my eBay page. I know these have been requested time and time again for a while, so I'm pleased to say that you can now finally buy them. Like my other 3D printed customs, these fit onto a standard sized chassis, such as one from a cargo car or a circus car. Just unscrew the top, taper glue down the truck, and there you go. But remember, you only get the truck piece, not the chassis. Go check out my eBay page if you want to get one of these, or other items. That's pretty much all I have to say about the trucks though. I'll probably talk about them again sometime when I paint more for myself, but all that you see here now is all that I've made. Thank you all for watching, and I hope to see you again soon.